Gladys Kathome Kaburu passed on a week ago at the St. Anne Mission Hospital in Ngoji, Meru County. Family and friends eulogized her as a comrade and a beacon of hope for many. Tumepoteza kijana chupavu. Kwa sababu kadhomi, karakter yake, wakati tumekua na yetu kifanya nae kazi, kadhomi alikuwa msema kweli. Akuwa na ataka mambo ya kujificha. Ukeanza kuficha ficha maneno kadhomi na kwambia wewe, awedi jia mzuri. Gladys was at the time of her demise a correspondent for Mwango FM, one of the radio stations under the Kenya Broadcasting Corporation Vernacular Bouquet. Colleagues at KBC spoke of her professionalism and dedication to work over the four years she has been based at Tharakanithi. <laughs> We are really at a loss. The gap you have left, no one can fill. You took good care of us as Mogo FM. We may get a replacement of a reporter, but we will never get one as you. We pray that we shall meet again our dear girl. It may not be today, tomorrow, or the day after, but still, it is not forever. Kathomi is survived by her husband, Mutemembi Muirigi, and daughter Natasha Ntinyare. For Channel 1 News, I am Emily K. Buddy.